So the first DIY is going to be washi tape covered, and, I mean pencils that is wrapped in washi tapes. Okay, so what you need is, of course, um, washi tapes. I have about, well, six. And one clear tape if we do need it. But I don't think so. We might need it. And scissors. Here's your pencil, which is not really a pencil, it's a Okay, so what you need to do is take one washi tape color, like the color of the, what, the pencil that you want. Well, no, the color of the pencil is green, but the washi tape color. So I want this washi tape color, which is three types of pink. What you want to do is um, make sure it's the same length as, it, as the pencil. So, first you want to start from up here. It's okay if there's still a bit green. I mean, so, you just have to make sure it's straight. That's all, as long as it's not tilted to the left. So at the bottom here, you cut the tape. And shoot, shoot! Okay. <laughs> Sorry about that. Okay, so just wrap the tape over the pencil. And then again, if you want to use the same uh, washi tape that you just used, you can. But right now, I'm gonna use. Uh, I'm going to use the butterfly one for the other side of the pencil which is not covered, you see? So, like we did, just measure the length of the pencil and cut it. Yes, this is not great. Ah, it's horrible. All you have to do is just sharpen it, sharpen it. Sometimes it's a bit hard though because there's a lot of tape on it. Okay, so every single time you sharpen it, it, it just, like, the sharpener would also sharpen the tape, so that's okay. So that's cute. So now let's get on with the DIY number two. So here's the second DIY, which is a washi tape bookmark. So here's my Ever After High novel. If any of you are Ever After High fans, please comment below and like this video. Well, yeah. Okay. So. Oh wait, where's the? Ooh, look at that. <laughs> okay, so here's the washi tape bookmark. So this is really easy to do. Um, all you need is, of course, washi tapes and scissors. And if you want to, you can write something on the washi tape. You could just take a marker. Sharpie, make my sh Sharpie marker, maybe, I think. Okay. So, let's get on to it. So, what you need to do is just... I think it's better to do this DIY on a table so that you can, like, stick the washi tape on the table at home. Okay, maybe I'm 
make it as long as you want. Like, it doesn't matter. Does it will depend on how wide your um, washi tape would be. And also, the more washi tape you put on, depends on how long the washi tape is. I mean, the hook is. So, just put it in random. Just turn it over, that's kind of hard sometimes. So, let's take this first. Okay, so here's how it looks like. So, what you have to do here is just well really easy um just fold it to the other side how hard is that but well it is kind of hard but most people might say it's a piece of cake well sometimes it does get a lot sticky so okay i got to the other side oh my gosh it really, looks like it's from the the shape of it, just cut it with scissors. And also you can cut up and it's the thumb back. 
said, this is DIY number three, which is the last one. Oh, the day goes so fast. Anyways, we could see each other again. So here's just a normal notebook for school. So the th third DIY is basically a sticker washi tape. This is a cat, but you can't really see it because like of the wall. So, picture of the book, but I'm pulling it off and putting it here so you can see. Oh, so, so that's a cat sticker. So, okay, now today I'll be showing you how to make it. It's really, really quite easy. And as usual, you'll need washi tapes and scissors. So, what you gotta do now is similar to the one that we just did, which is the bookmark DIY. But this one, it doesn't matter what, whatever you do. Just like, oops. Just like tape it all over the place. I'm gonna use only one type of color, which is the butterfly. Which I'm sure is hard to see what I'm making because it's a picture of a butterfly and can't really see the picture I'm going to draw. Wow, there's thousands of butterflies! I'm done. So what you need now is some um, pens or markers, anything. Just draw any picture you want, which is like the sticker you want. So I just made a cat sticker. Maybe I'll just make a butterfly sticker now. So draw a butterfly. Well, it's not really. I'm not really going to cut through the antennas though, but I am going to cut the body and the wings. I'm not really good at drawing, especially on wash tapes, but sometimes my drawing are very good, but sometimes no, sometimes they look horrible. I'm gonna color in the well, wait. Well, half of it so that this is like half pink and the other is like another color. And I'm gonna do this on the other side. And maybe circles. do now oops the ink is not dry yet okay just peel it off oops this this might take a while or not oops maybe it take a while well maybe just a few seconds is really sticky but it's just like cutting through paper except a sticky type of paper
Okay, anyways, I'm gonna fast this, like, fast forward this video. So, okay, bye. I'll show you how it looks like after it's been cut. So, here I finished cutting the butterfly sticker. Now, I could stick it on to my notebook. Today was a really great fun doing all this. Anyways, so right now I'm gonna show you all the DIYs we did together. Or maybe I did them myself. Anyways, but hope you like it though. Here's the bookmark, here's the sticker, and wait, where's the. So washi tape, I mean pencil covered in washi tape, I mean wrapped, and washi tape sticker, and washi tape bookmark. So bye, see you next time. Bye 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 bye. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment below. Bye bye. Bye, I mean, and by the way, um, the person who was filming this video wasn't me, but usually it was me. But the person who's filming this video, I'd like to introduce my second, I mean, my first sister. Her name is... I forgot her name. Oh yeah, Afrin Dani. But you could call her Dani or Afrin. But most people like Malaysian friends.